Well, good day to you on a great day here, which uh, promises rain, but promises way beyond that what should be a really good game of football. The stands are packed here, people have done everything they can to get here. I think the roads outside were pretty badly clogged, but I think most of the traffic issues have been settled. And indeed, I think most people have now got through the turnstiles and are well covered up against the elements, whatever they may throw at us over the next hour or two. This must be amongst the favoured arenas of supporters all over the world. It really does have a very special feel to it. Action has already started. The signal to start the final round of fixtures in part one of two this season. So, Jim, tell me this, who are you looking for in particular here? I'm going to pick João Moutinho. I call him the ferret because he can slip into places and cause trouble before opponents can react. He loves to get between the lines and, and then get his head up. A real creative force. Yes, he'd be my pick too. It's going to be all about how they get the best out of him. It's a little unfortunate, he had a lot of people worried about. Defensive record. And here's Immobile. That's just very well played. He can't hurt you with his back to goal, and he didn't go for the back heel. Long ball, but not especially accurate. And they are working very hard to get it wide now, Jim. Yeah, I think they've decided to concentrate on, on working the flanks to help the production line. It's, uh, it's where the room is. Jose, real chance to break. Well, we've reached the halfway point of the season, and remarkably, this perfect streak is still going. This is the time when everyone starts to talk about winter transfers, but do you think a team like this really needs to bring someone in? Listen, not for me. This team doesn't need tampering with just yet. How can you want to change such a, a tremendous achievement? But I admit there's always room for a fresh face, a, a new influence. You've always got to have one eye on the future, I suppose. Good challenge. He just stood firm. He is not one readily to admit defeat. Don't be surprised if he tries that again. tested the keeper Immobile really must have felt he had the measure of the keeper then but how wrong he was Alexander Arnold plays it short. Still goalless. Ruben Levers. His team's come back in his last outing with a brilliant solo effort in the second half. So, Wolverhampton coming into this game on the back of a really good result. And there, uh, goes for goal! Surely this time, goal! Rui Patricio reacted well to the initial effort, but couldn't get it right out of the danger area. 
Well, look, regardless of whether the keeper could have done better or not, Peter, that was all down to the excellent movement in getting into the right position to apply the final touch. Liverpool put themselves into the lead. He's just gone and reminded us yet again of what a threat he carries. Fernandez. Hardly anything between the sides. And the score is 1-0. Referee's given a throw. Here's the cross. Mohamed Salah. Firmino. Thiago. And here's Sterling. And, he and the finish! He has done it! And they're at it again in double quick time. What a great finish, but how about the touch? It just allowed him to put the ball exactly where he wanted it, and the rest became a formality. Liverpool take a two-goal lead, and things should be comfortable from here on in. Well, they're very much the better team at the moment, Peter, and, and no doubt we'll be looking to, to cause even more damage here. Sterling is on a run down the left wing. What a throw in. Jose desperately wants to get on the end of this. Salah. Immobile! A collective sigh of relief from the defence. Well, I think the opposition was pretty sloppy in creating a problem for themselves then, but he was onto it so quickly and very nearly made them take. Sterling. De Donka positions himself well and cuts it out. Fernandez plays it forward. Forward it goes. Robertson. Thiago. And here's Immobile. They've been denied a chance to develop any rhythm in the passing department. Turns and goes. Immobile hits it! And the keeper barely had to move. Look, that makes it easier for the keeper. And the first half is done. It's the first half compared with your expectation. Liverpool are two up and everything is shaping nicely. The only criticism, it could have been three. Liverpool go in at half-time on a comfortable two-goal cushion.
So off we go once more. No changes at half time that we're aware of. And it's Jose. Tries to dink it in. It's Rafinha. Jose. Jose. A retrieve, albeit perhaps momentary. Alexander Arnold. Mohamed Salah. Alexander Arnold. Finds himself eased off the ball. Is that a foul? Yes, the uh, referee's given it. Rafinha Pedro Neto Jose Rafinha Looks to thread it through And it's hoisted clear Pedro Neto! Last ditch defending, but that'll do. A really good feat from him. Whipped in. Well, that's the first attempt, Peter, we've seen of one of those breaking passes just to spread the play. Thiago tries to get it forward quickly. And no, that is pretty much the end of that. Fernandez to play it forward. And the weighted pass. No, that's not the ball he wanted. Well, no doubt someone is being given special treatment here. Yeah, and having notched the goal already, Peter, he's not going to be allowed to run off the shoulders as much as he'll want. Kabak drives it forward. Hoists it forward. More than happy to take the muscular approach And it's played forward Liverpool clearly aren't looking comfortable on the ball at the moment Predictability has just crept into their play Mohamed Salah Plus we need to be better than that And he knows it Well positioned to make that interception Moutinho Bolly Bolly goes looking too much on it and out of play Wolverhampton can make their change now with uh, a break in play Come It's Salah. Into the last quarter of an hour. Mohamed Salah. And here's Sterling. Pedro Neto. Bentonka. Try something new. Hoist it forward. (laughs) 
Traore. And Dyke gets it back. Thiago plays it forward. Has he picked him out? Rui Patricio deals with it effortlessly. Ruben Neves. Xiao Moutinho. Pedro Neto. And here's Traore. Pedro Neto. in the box if he gets his head up. Semedo is losing it possible to wrestle off the ball. Wijnaldum tries to get it forward quickly. Nelson Semedo. Crosses it. Keeper's ball. The referee brings it to a close. Liverpool have won it. As much industry as inspiration. Whatever the formula, it has worked for them. How would you summarise what we've seen today then, Jim? Of course, we all know you want to good defence too. And their organisation and discipline has helped during this win.